your question is solve the simultaneous equation what they have given 4x minus 3y is equal to 5 here they have given x square plus 3xy is equal to 10 now what we have to do just you have to check it first what they have given here they have given minus 3y and here they have given 3y just first we from the first equation we will find out 3y is what bring minus 3y is here 3y is equal to what 5 minus 4x now make 3y as like this 3y so we will change the sign what is that 3y is equal to we can say minus 5 plus 4x now substitute this 3y here we will get x square plus 3y is this way. So that is your 4x minus 5. We can write it as 4x minus 5. And x is there. That is equal to 10. Now solve this. We get x square plus 4x into x is 4x square minus 5x bring this to this side minus 10 that is equal to 0 now solve this you will get 5x square 5x square minus 5x minus 10 that gives you 0 now divide by 5 y means every coefficient is divided by 5 we will simply divide it by 5. We will get x square minus x minus 2. That gives you 0. Now we will go for a middle term splitting. We will get x square minus 2x plus x minus 2. That gives you 0. What is common here? X is common. We will write that. X is common and remaining is X minus 2. Here nothing is common that means 1 is common. Plus 1 you will get X minus 2 that gives you 0. Now the factors are X minus 2 and X plus 1 that gives you 0. That means that x minus 2 is equal to 0 or x plus 1 is equal to 0. Now the value of x is equal to 2 or x is equal to minus 1. Now substitute this value. Where you will substitute in any one. You will get your y value. So we will substitute here. We will get 3y is equal to minus 5 plus 4 into x is 2. We will take first this 2. That is equal to minus 5 plus 8. 3y is equal to 3. Therefore y is equal to we can say it's a 1. Now we will take x is equal to minus 1. We will get 3y is equal to minus 5 plus 4 into minus 1. That is equal to minus 5 minus 4. And here 3y is there. 3y is equal to minus 9. y is equal to we can say minus 3. Like this you have to 